Hi guys, it's a great day out here at Johnson RV in beautiful Puyallup, Washington. My name is Hugh Gabrielson. I'm going to take you on a quick tour of this 2013 Coachman Freelander 29QR. Uh, before I give you the quick tour, I just want to give you a little background on Johnson RV. We have a buying department that buys nationwide and we buy the most uh, lowest miles, gently used uh, RVs out there. And our technicians go through these and ensure that they're as close to new condition as possible. Let's uh, take a quick tour here. <clears throat> this is a Class C motorhome. This is on the Ford 450 chassis. Has collapsible mirrors here. Here's you got your overhead uh, uh, cap. That's where the bed is. Down below here, got a nice little storage setup. Room for uh, small uh, chairs or or just a uh, little storage here and there. You do have a nice uh, awning that's uh, about three quarters of the coach here. Fully extends out. The family can have a lot of fun with that, whether it's raining uh, or really hot out. Here you do have your uh, <clears throat> uh, cable hookups, plug-ins. Swing back here, you have this large storage space. Um, you can really bring along everything uh, when you go camping. If you got kids or it's just uh, some hobbies that you uh, need space for large items. <clears throat> now you can enter this from any uh, three spaces here. So if you have something awkward, you can really uh, uh, put that in there really easily. This is set up with a 5,000 pound tow hitch. Swing around here on this side your fuel station, your fresh water connections, spot for your, uh, this is your 110 power source here. You do have uh, your sewer gray black water hookups right underneath here, very easily accessible. Your generator, your 4,000 watt Onan generator is located down here. This is your exhaust for that. The six gallon hot water tank. This is the slide out for the living area. You notice you got the nice slide topper up there. That's a great, keeps that debris or water from settling on that slide. You do have your tinted uh, windows here. Let's uh, swing on inside, take a peek. All right guys, thanks for joining me inside. Up here in the front cab area, uh, you notice you could sleep two full-size adults up here. This TV does swing in and out. Uh, and you can put as big of a TV on here as, as you like. Um, down here, uh, it's, you got everything uh, at the driver's fingertips. You can definitely, you can have this down or up, give you more uh, uh, feeling of uh, more headroom there. Here in the, you got the booth dinette. Now you do have two seat belts on each side. Uh, this does collapse into a bed and you have plenty of storage underneath here. Up above, you have the large storage cabinets. Look at the, the depth on those, um, a lot of space. You do have a curtain does pr make this private here in the front area. Uh, you do have your ducted air in here, cools down very efficiently, and your ducted heat. Um, here you have uh, your nice sofa that turns into a, uh, a bed. It's got three seat belts here. And again, a uh, common theme here, a lot of storage up above. Up here in the kitchen area, it's really cool. You got your uh, stainless steel sink here, two sinks. You got your nice little countertop here. Great for, uh, you know, if you're preparing food or setting food out, uh, if you have a large group of people coming over to your campsite. Right here behind me, you got your microwave, um, your three burner stove top, your oven, and then you got storage down below for those larger pots and pans. Again, uh, storage up above here, nice little spice rack. You got plugins all throughout. Right here, your entryway coming into the door here, you got a nice uh, storage uh, set up here for your miscellaneous things. You really want to grab when you head out uh, for the day of hiking or whatnot. Do you have a rack up here? Great for magazines, uh, maps, your power uh, shut off. Right here, you can turn off all the power to the coach right when you leave, not having to worry about running around, turning all the lights off. So here you got your uh, nice size freezer and fridge. This does run off propane and electric. It's always gonna take the most resourceful power. Uh, so you're not gonna have to worry about, uh, you know, burning up uh, your LP if you're plugged in. 
uh, here you got your, uh, your, your control panel here for your slide outs, for your, uh, you have a, um, also your, uh, for your furnace and your, your AC and your generator. Everything's right there, easy to use. All right, swing on back here. Now check this out. You get this full size shower here. I'm six foot three. I can jump in here. And then you notice I got the, the elbow uh, room. So I can go in there, shower, uh, really have uh, plenty of room. You get your nice walk around queen bed here. Now you do have a, a nice setup here. If you do have a sleep out machine, you can set it right there with drawers on each side. Again, large cabinets um, on each side. Now right here, this is where you uh, have the bathroom. Plenty of leg space down there in front of the toilet. Uh, check that out. And you have uh, cabinets uh, all around there. So I'm sure you guys got a few more questions. Give you a call, 1-888-833-9766. I look forward to hearing from you. Thank you. Bye.